A blessed morning, Grateful Gap. I'm going to dive directly into the daily verse. Hope everyone had a great week. It's Friday. Um, you know, the working people will be going into the weekend and have some time off, hopefully. You all you all get to be able to enjoy yourself, enjoy your families, you know, have some long, a long time, whatever type of plans you have you know, for your weekend. I hope, hope everything goes as well and, and you get your stuff accomplished. Everyone have a safe weekend, fun, love field, all things of that nature. I'm going to dive directly into the daily verse um, for May 20th, 2022. Come from the book of 1 John, chapter 2, verse 15. Love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. And again, it's from the book of 1 John, chapter 2, verse 15. And uh, yeah, so this morning, it won't be um, long, not to, you know, not to speak about too too much anything like that um just really want to be able to get on here you know every day and just be able to have a positive you know message and impact for the listeners and viewers and things of that nature and uh just today about you know perseverance what do we do to to persevere through any you know any of our um what's the word i'm looking for i'm sorry any trials or any um inefficient moments in our lives or you know inadequate um inadequate not responses but um what am i looking for yeah just we got to persevere though y'all i'm sorry I, I i couldn't think of the word i was looking for um but yeah man just what do we do to be able to put ourselves in the best position to accomplish or push through whatever we have to push through to accomplish a goal you know what I mean? Because that's even life period. You know what I mean? We have to persevere every day. You know what I mean? Some of our lifestyle situations come from, you know, living in, and you know, the worst situ the worst, you know, living conditions that America, you know, has to offer and things like that. And, you know, some of us are coming up in places in America, you know, that are considered third world countries. And, you know, in a country that's supposed to be one of the strongest and most advanced countries in the world. And then a lot of those people, you know, continue that cycle, but then uh, some of those people, they want more, and they they look into themselves, and they they see how they can persevere, and you know, get through anything, any type of trial or tribulation that's in their lives that's going to hinder them, or it's going to, you know, put a put a blockade in their in their path. They're going to do what they have to do to be able to get over that. Yes, baby. Daddy is doing his podcast right now. You want to say something to the podcast? Yeah. Okay, hold on. Here I come. My beautiful daughter, Zuri. She's about to be a big sister soon. Very, very excited. Say hi. Hi. Are you having a good day? Yeah. I love you. I you love me? Yeah. Okay. I'll be in there in a second, okay? Why are calling you? Nobody calling me. Daddy on this podcast right now. You gonna, be, you gonna do an episode with me? Yeah. You gonna be my special guest? Yeah. Yeah. I love you. Can okay. you Yes, go back in the house, please. Daddy gonna see you in a minute, okay? Yeah, so. Man, I love it, man. My daughter, they're just growing. She's three. Um, her, her sister will be here in less than two weeks, so she's very excited. Um, you know, very curious about different things as she grows and uh she just always continue to learn every day you know yeah so this is you know a big reason why i get up and i do what i gotta do because i know there's a lot of parents out there like myself you know who cherish their children who cherish moments and cherish the times in their lives with their kids and again you know a lot of those parents like myself you know put those put their children in their mind to to be able to persevere over in, you know in any situation that they have to you know overcome and things like that in their lives to be successful, you know, because it's not just about them anymore. It's about their children, who they have, you know, who, who who's depending on them. You know, just like just like myself and my wife, we have our children that depend on us. So, again, that's why it's just so important for me to be able to, you know, get up every day and, and don't take it for granted and be able to thank God that, you know, he was able to put my children in my life for a reason. You know what I mean? It's, it's very important to me to be a father and a husband and i take those things seriously and um if i do see myself i think i'm doing pretty good at it i can always work on more things you know that's why that's why 
the days that we do get are very important so that we are able to work on ourselves to be better, to be able to try to get to the point of, you know, not perfect, but, you know, as near as perfect for yourself and then the people who are around you as well, you know what I mean? So don't ever beat up ourselves for not being perfect because we're not, but it's never, it's never, it doesn't hurt to be able to, it doesn't hurt to try, you know what I mean? So um, again, y'all just, you know, perseverance, perseverance, perseverance. You have to be able to overcome and push through anything that life throws at us. You know what I mean? So, you know, God gives us God gives us the strength to be able to handle and you know <clears throat> be able to stand up to whatever you know type of turmoil or, or any you know distraught things in our lives that happen. So again, just very blessed to be able to you know get on my platform on the day that God has given me so far for my platform. I think I'm like almost forty episodes in, like forty days straight. You know, I just thank God, man. Again, I just thank God for a lot, you know, continue to give me the motivation to be able to get on this platform and speak positivity. Um, you know, let y'all know that y'all can do anything. You know, if you put your mind to it, God will bless you. God will bless you if you if you're doing the right things in your life. God will bless you if you 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 have a great heart and you and you you putting yourself, you putting others before you. You know, what I mean, sometimes God, you know, God sees all those type of things. God sees who you gen- genuinely are. And if you're genuinely a good person, you know what I mean, good things wouldn't come to you. And if you're genuinely a bad person, you know what I mean, you, you know that you know the outcomes. So again, y'all, we just get on, you know, every day we get up, don't take it for granted, thank the Lord, and, and let's make the best of it every day, y'all. Every day. But until next time, grateful gab. Really appreciate y'all tuning in. It's always a pleasure. More um special guest episodes will be following here in the next couple of weeks. Um, it's a lot going on. Again, in these next couple of weeks for me and my family. Uh, we will be um, expecting our daughter, she will be arriving here in the next couple of weeks. So our family's about to, you know, multiply. And uh, yeah, we're just very, very excited, you know, for what the future holds for us and all the blessings that God has, you know, um, bestowed upon us, the ones we've seen and the ones we haven't seen. And it just, I just thank you anyway, Lord. But again, y'all, y'all have a blessed day. Enjoy your weekend. Safe travels. If anybody, you know, traveling around, out of state, out of the city, whatever you're going, you know, enjoy yourselves. Around the water, make sure y'all know how to swim. If y'all don't know how to swim, you know, uh, get the get the right measure, not the right measurement. Um, have the right tools and the right equipment to be able to protect yourself and make sure you know you you all are good to go while you all out in the water and things of that nature. Um, so until next time, grateful gap, peace.